Her Majesty has taken her own life. Was it you? Did you do this? I would have, but she died before I got to her. You're a murderer all the same! Believe whatever you like. All is as Lord Odin wills it. What's wrong with God's reincarnating souls? <laughs> Why? Why do you side with her? The bottom line is that I work for Odin now. A conscience is a luxury I can't afford. You traitor! What could the few of you ever do? It's always the same with you, justifying your sins in Odin's name. I'm sick of hearing about the will of Odin. I want to hear what you think. Listen to yourself. You've forgotten that serving Odin is the substance of our being. No! Nothing gives the gods the right to toy with human lives! <coughs> you seek the ephemeral solace of combat. Then you shall have it. If you do not seek death, then hide yourself away.
What is it? The Sovereign's right! Those humans. How could they? Who will the Lord of the Undead sight? Distortion. That lattice.
You've done well. But still... The humans were somehow able to perform the Sovereign's right. Will you allow this to stand? Prist has been returned safely to us. Seeing as how they ultimately failed, why bother following them? Had I not stopped them, they might have succeeded. And we don't know where Somaria is. Two Valkyries are not meant to exist simultaneously in our world to begin with. The Mage False Sovereign's right extricated her. Surely her transmigration succeeded this time. In the end, they saved us the trouble. Do you think so? What do you suppose? The Lord of the Undead cast some sort of spell. When he did, I sensed something strange. Some sort of distortion. You sure you weren't deceived by this evil spirit? You don't sound like yourself. With the orb now in my hands, the deterioration of Midgard increases all the more. I had planned to stabilize it by using that fiend's soul as a power source. But better I let Midgard perish along with all knowledge of the Sovereign's right. Alas, my sought-after prize is now useless.